हेलो डियर मैकेनिकल स्टूडेंट्स ऑन फोर्थ फरवरी अप्रॉक्सीमेटली एट्टी एट थाउजेंड मैकेनिकल स्टूडेंट्स हु हैव रजिस्टर्ड फॉर द गेट टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री एग्जामिनेशन एंड अप्रॉक्सीमेटली एट्टी परसेंट ऑफ देम हैव अपियर्ड एंड हैव गिवन द मैकेनिकल एग्जाम इन द सिंगल शिफ्ट दैट इज द आफ्टरनून शिफ्ट वट वॉज द ओवरऑल डिफिकल्टी लेवल एक्सपेक्टेड कट ऑफ एक्सपेक्टेड कट ऑफ फॉर एम टेक एक्सपेक्टेड कट ऑफ फॉर पी एस यू and the distribution of uh, the exam or distribution of subjects we will be discussing in this brief discussion for you and this will not be only helping for those students those who have given the exam for analysis their performance but for all future aspirants who will be giving the examination in coming years they can also get to know about the recent trend weightage analysis and difficulty level so to start with first of all let me tell you that the total number of msq questions were 8 NAT questions were twenty five and MCQ questions were thirty two. So let us ask first of all, dear sir, dear sir, what was the difficulty level? Or uh, the student expect kya tha? The paper was expected to that or some part or some topics have come from the strange topics also. Uh, sir, I would like to say uh, that if we see the examination paper, so uh, generally uh, whatever the previous year's papers or trends were there, uh, this time it have been changed. Like if we see the level of paper, I will say it is moderate actually, uh, because from some of the subjects questions were very easy, but from some of the subjects questions were not difficult. I will say uh, they were from the uh, the topics which were never asked before. Okay. Like if I talk about production, uh, the maximum weight is still eight. was 80 marks but this time it came for 23 and and the questions were from untouched areas like uh, previously they were not asking much from material science so majority of the students were leaving that topic but this year question came from that topics and uh, they were also the types of question which were before never asked and also if we talk about uh, some questions were there from inspection devices they were also like uh, previously they were not coming or students were not doing those kind of things so uh, that kind of things were there so i will no, will not say that paper was difficult much but it was different i will say okay and uh, from last year also uh, if you see last year it was different as well as difficult but this year it was different only so uh, some of the subject like strength of material machine design very easy questions were also there so i would like to say that it was moderate paper but yes definitely as some things were from untouched areas so definitely it will affect the expected marks and everything but otherwise uh, it was okay means agar aap syllabus pura karke ja rahe ho to there should not be any problem okay Uh, so guys uh, let me also tell you about strength of materials four questions were of one marks four questions of two marks total 12 marks and uh, me and dhira sir both have solved those questions and uh, apart from a uh, couple of questions all questions were i'm not even saying moderate mm -hmm. they are saying easy questions okay so i hope that the strength of material parts most of you have solved might be in production uh, might not be there solving all types of question or all uh, questions but still strength of material they can score better than production yes yes so machine design it was good and and weightage was also this time more for some okay if you see Okay, now let's come to your favorite Surat sir. Surat sir, please tell us about your subjects also and yes. about the length length of the paper. Was it lengthy, calculative? Uh, no. If I talk about theory of machine, uh, they have used the same pattern. Like uh, the favorite topics are gear and gear train and vibration. But the thing is the difficulty level. If I say they have reduced in that in that sense because normally they are asking a very good level of question from vibration. But this year they have. Uh, if you are only having a basic concept, I think you can easily solve. and uh, definitely if i talk about other topics like gear trains and even uh, your eye center approach they have is uh, they have uh, asked about a very direct straight forward question so i think sir if you are having a strong concept understanding only over your understanding you will be able to secure 100% marks in this uh, theory of machine and if i talking about industrial engineering as always said there are two hot topics in every session we are saying that uh, inventory and lpp linear programming these are the two hot topics that every student should not be skipping out and from that also they have asked only the basic question so i think uh, overall if i say except like uh, i had a discussion with dhira sir also except production engineering almost every subject was uh, we can say on on the lighter note right it was if you are having if you have completed the syllabus for once or twice revision has been done i think you will be able to solve very easily it was not a lengthy problem uh, from tom and i and definitely it was a very scoring portion also sir okay so लेट्स कम नाउ टू द चंद्रशेखर सर सर आपका सब्जेक्ट का क्या हाल है फ्लूड मैकेनिक्स एंड एच एम टी एंड अदर सब्जेक्ट्स लेंदी थे वॉज अ डिफिकल्ट मॉडरेट एंड वट वॉज द वेटेज ऑफ दो सब्जेक्ट्स स्पेशली एच एम टी एंड फ्लूड मैकेनिक्स 
सर इन फ्लूड मैकेनिक्स एंड एच एम टी आई कैन से विद कॉन्फिडेंस दैट वॉट एवर वी हैड डिस्कस द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स दिस टाइम ओनली द क्वेश्चन वर आज फ्रॉम द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स विच वी हैड बीन पुटिंग फोकस मोर ऑन टू so very simple questions basic questions but because it is 65 questions only so every area cannot be touched but in my subjects fluid mechanics and heat transfer only those topics were asked which were expected okay or fluid <laughs> mechanics mein jaise uh, it carried 9 marks five questions were there very simple questions bernoulli equation the question was asked uh, from the continuity equation continuity equation it was a little uh, on the uh, conceptual side because compressible flow continuity equation for compressible flow as normally we apply continuity equation in fluid mechanics for incompressible flow uh, for compressible flow it is thermodynamic but okay. the question was asked for compressible flow and uh, in heat transfer there were two msqs and which were very simple okay and uh, most of the students always afraid that uh, the revision of the formula is a tough task in mechanical engineering so many formulas are there students may not uh, memorize those all formula but this time there was no use of memorizing the formula because very basic questions were asked in heat transfer as well so i would say fluid mechanics and heat transfer was on the easier side very easy okay. only one question from the fluid <clears throat> mechanics was the lengthy but what was not tough there was no question from the hydraulic machine even otherwise hydraulic machine is the topic which creates a difference because most of the students are not very much comfortable in hydraulic machine but this time they did not ask anything from the hydraulic machine okay okay guys let me just quickly tell you about strength of materials also one question was thermal stress uh, msq question tha, that was easy strain energy se deflection nikalna tha that was also not very challenging mm. and uh, one question was from uh, the plastic strain diagram that question uh, we are accepting that till now many students have given us uh, the question but we are not still finding that what was the correct question that was asked here that mm. is why we tell all the possibilities, all the possibilities. Oh, the, for this was the question then this was the answer we tell all the possibilities me and dheeraj sir mm. one question was thermal stress that was again msq yes. and so one uh, question one was, was from thin cylinder thin cylinder and that controversial was gate gate 2011 questions and that was very much similar to gate 2011 questions us uh, uh, 2011 mein wo bahut sare books mein galat answer bhi de rakha hai uska this is the similar question and we when we were doing that we were saying that this type of case can be Uh, come again for the gate exam. Okay, and one was the stiffness of cantilever. Yes, that sir. was, I guess, the easiest question of all sixty five question. Yes, yes. <laughs> that okay. was the easier. And one question was there uh, from theory of failure. That was also MSQ. And in production also there were two MSQs. So MSQs uh, slightly made difference in the theory question actually. <laughs> okay. Now the thermal champion is with us, <laughs> Sonu Chauhan sir. Uh, Sonu sir, uh, with your subjects, what the length, what was the weightage, and from which parts the question was asked. so if we talk about the thermal portion sir so in thermal portion the level of question was quite moderate even if i'll say level then it was the easy but because a uh, few question are directly based on the formula but these question are from the area which was not used to ask in the previous years like most of the question if we talk about the power plant or the thermal they expect that either question will be asked from the entropy work done uh, first law of thermodynamic or britten cycle refrigeration ic engine this time there was no question from these all the topics the question was related to the uh, compressible flow or gas mixture so the point is this if number of student have just study these points if they are aware with the compressible flow they will be easy, uh, easily able to write the answer so that's why the uh, level of question in the thermodynamic is quite moderate because few question are asked from the area which are not expected by the student and in the engineering mechanics definitely the level of question was uh, moderate to hard because one to two question was the not uh, one i think one only the question related to truss was based on the simple formula or the concept and other two question you have to do something then and only then you get the answer so this was moderate to hard we can say engineering mechanics Okay. sir uh, one thing i have noticed uh, yeah, in this paper not only in this paper in every paper gate paper what i notice is uh, because uh, in mechanical engineering so many subjects are having intermixing concept so sometimes what happens when we read the first line we are not sure whether the question is from fluid mechanics heat transfer thermodynamics right <laughs> so there are people which might be showing that uh, the fluid mechanics not carried 9 marks 8 marks yes, yes, or yes, yes, yes. heat transfer carrying more marks exactly so, exactly 
in first go students feel that the question is from fluid mechanics but it is not actually the fluid mechanics question <laughs> sir, sir, one, 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 one question uh, was there sir actually <laughs> <laughs> actually what happened there was a statement of work sampling i think so many students have left that because it is not included in the gate syllabus right it is directly in the ese po portion but if you read the question at the end it was having slight information related to i think metrology sir mm -hmm. so metrology ka question tha wo but bahut logo ne it was from tolerance uh, tolerance ha to tolerance se they have asked but uh, in the starting they have used some terminology as work sampling six sigma many many uh, terminologies from industrial part but ultimately wo question tha aapka production ka mm -hmm. so yahan par bhi they have uh, played a very uh, uh, आधे लोगों ने छोड़ दिया मतलब इस बार अलग ये हुआ की जनरली जो लेंदी क्वेश्चन आते हैं वो मशीन डिजाइन से आते हैं हाँ। वो वाइब्रेशन से आते हैं और इसमें मशीन डिजाइन के क्वेश्चन ऐसे थे कि शायद आप बिना पेन चलाए सोल्व कर दो लाइक ऐसे डायग्राम में तो आपको ये पूछा था एंडोरेंस लिमिट कौन सा पॉइंट शो कर रहा है इट वाज लाइक जैसे शेयर सेंटर का क्वेश्चन आता है कि इन चार में से कौन सा पॉइंट शेयर सेंटर है तो दैट काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन वाज देयर एंड इन मशीन डिजाइन सेकंड क्वेश्चन वाज फ्रॉम दैट ब्रेक t1 by t2 e to the power mu theta so uh, that is very very easy question so uh, in machine design they were not uh, lengthy question they were very easy and in production some questions were lengthy so there was nothing like from outside the course everything was from the course only but the point is when we see the previous years so what generally students are doing ki the topics which are repeatedly coming we are more focusing on them and we are not focusing when i have uh, taken the material science marathon you can even compare when material science marathon was there and when Uh, we were having the marathon of metal cutting and you can see the number of student difference there only so <laughs> that, that tells that in which topics we are more concentrating like uh, at least 20 30 percent student have priorly made mind we will not do material science why to study 15 hour subject when the weightage is 0 to 1 to mark. Mark. but i already told many times even in marathon i told that in 2019 or 18 four marks ka, came from material science so don't think ki aayega nahi aur jab aayega to fir wo sab ki looti hado aayega aur aur many students have message me sir ki i have left that subject but uh, i have done the marathon and based on that only i am able to solve the question so that was a good thing ki agar aapne us din 4 ghante bhi pad liya hota to wo aapko affect karta so that thing is also there sir bilkul sir finally Uh, many students have already given the exam, and some students will be giving exam in 2024 or 25. So the final words for the students: What can be the safe score for M Tech and same safe score for PSU? Uh, sir, first of all, uh, the cutoff expected. If you are talking about, I feel that it should be around 30 somewhere. Uh, plus minus one two marks can be there, and for PSUs I feel seventy uh, two plus marks if he is getting that the chances are fair. Number of PSUs also yes PSUs increasing. Especially ONGCs obviously yeah. obviously and sir uh, like uh, one more thing is there like for M Tech also uh, many people are diverting towards the other options also so that is why that uh, in M Tech also now we are getting the admissions into higher ranks also so I feel if you are getting sixty two plus marks then high chances are there that you will get into some IIT yeah. so there are chances. Okay, guys. So I hope you got benefited from this panel discussion, and uh, we have also tell you the safe score if gate cut off and safe score for IIT and PSU. So accordingly, you can plan your future. Of course, we are coming with rank predictor also. Once the response key will be out, we'll be coming with uh, the rank predictor, and then there you can put your uh, response key, and you will can get your All India expected rank. Okay, so that will be getting there, and of course, uh, the complete PDF of solutions will be available. on our app and we'll be putting that link on our youtube channel also okay so guys thank you take care and plan accordingly uh, wish you all the best and our whole team whole baju jam prep team is with you before the exam and after the exam guys don't worry about that for any any support we'll always be there thank you